What's good, YouTube? It's your boy JML Flow back with another Madden 17 tip video. And this might sound a little funny, but I'm basically saying how to aggressive catch more consistently and throwing less picks. Now, I'm not someone who goes out there aggressive catching, but I have noticed something when I need to act. I noticed something. Uh, it's really only two things. Uh, I want y'all to think about something. Say, uh, say like you was, uh, say you outside playing football, right? You and your brother going at it, boom, 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 ba da ba ba, bang, bang, bing, pow. Oh, but wait, before we get into it, before the, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, if y'all new to the channel, if not, like anyway. Uh, like if you enjoy this. Just like if you rock with your boy. Let's try to get a hundred likes. Uh, believe it or not, y'all, y'all liking the video actually helps the video grow a lot more than me just uploading videos. So that'd be really appreciated. Like I said, imagine y'all just outside, right? Uh, you and your brother playing football. You defending him. You the corner, boom. You the corner, boom. About to lock him down. Now say he they they throw it up. Now say y'all running, right? Y'all running, you in front of him. But say he cut like right inside of you, right before the ball get to you. There's that there, if anybody know play football, once he's inside of you and like the ball's coming, like if he's between you, if if there's you and the ball, if he gets in between you two, the only thing you can do is hope for that you can knock it out of his hand because he has inside leverage. That's what they call it. He got the inside leverage. He got the better position. So the only thing you can try to do is knock it out of his hand. You can't. And even if, and even if you, uh, even if you the cornerback, right? If you get in front of him and you get in between him and that ball, you gonna jump up and make that play. So basically, the first whoever got the better position, basically who got a better chance of making a play. And the same thing with aggressive catching. Y'all gonna see. Here's how aggressive catching look when y'all just throw it up, right? You throw it up. Uh, you hope you get there. Oh, snap, Terrence Williams really burns him. Like I said, you hope you get there. you just throwing the ball up. Boom. You ain't really pass leading it. You throw it up. This is how aggressive catching look in Madden. That time he caught it, it was like, all right, whatever. But that normally won't happen, especially with the swap button. But here's what happens. When you get inside position and you just move your receiver slightly inside, y'all see how the only thing the corner can do, the only thing he can do is bat the ball down. There's no way he making a play on that ball. It's no way he can make a play on that ball. Like y'all see, it's no way he can make a play on that ball. The only time they can get a pick is if I throw it and like we stay in stride. But I get inside leverage and then hold wide. There's no way he can make a play on the wall because because I'm it basically like I said, whoever touches the ball first is whoever got a better chance of making a play. Like y'all see. There's no way the cornerback. I'm not saying go out there and act catch like every play of the game, but if you ever need it, y'all y'all need to know what y'all doing. You need to know how football work. Y'all see, if they just throw it up and we run with the ball and we just both hold wide, it might happen. But y'all see, I move slightly inside. There's no way right here. Like look, look at this. This is why you get a lot of these animations. Look at this. There's no way. It's like when you box somebody out in basketball. There's no way he can get to that ball, right? He has to knock it out your hand. So then, boom, we got inside leverage. We get inside there, boom, you got a greater chance of catching the ball. So the only thing now they can do is swat it out. You don't really got to worry about picks as much. Y'all can see, uh, when I even when I add people, I just, boom, I move a little bit inside, and that's what happens most of the time. The only thing they can try to do is swat the ball, coach. It's the only thing they can try to do is swat the ball. I move, I just move inside. Look, look at that. I'm touching the ball first. I know this, this might be a messed up tip to pit out there, but I know everybody need an aggressive catch. I'm touching that ball first. Now, if he get to the ball and touch it first, look at that. Like, there, I, I'm just throwing ad catches. I have not made through one pick yet. Now, just say I throw it normal. Boom. This is how normally people throw ad catches. Now, look. Y'all see how the cornerback could have made a play on that ball? Y'all see how he could have made a play on that ball? Now, y'all see. Boom. I throw it. I'm going to just run, run inside and hold wide. And y'all, look at that, y'all. I'm telling y'all, y'all will have a better chances of catching these balls. You will throw less picks. Like, even with Cole Beasley. Oh, snap. Cole Beasley just can't get there. But even with Cole Beasley, we can do the same thing. And y'all think, oh, that's just Terrence Williams. Look at this. I, I just move inside. Oh, man, I almost swerved him low-key. Like I said, I, all I, all you do is get inside leverage when you once you throw the ball. Once you throw the ball, you just move inside and you hold wide. Well, Cole Beasley's just too slow and he's just too short. Y'all got somebody like Dez, anybody. Just get inside leverage. That's what it's all about. Look, I'm just slowly moving inside. It's nothing he can do. Like, you ain't going to get it. You ain't going to catch it every time. But yo, 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 eyes damn sure going to go up. 
I promise you that. Your eyes damn sure gonna go up. Look at this, y'all. Look at this. Now, if I throw it a normal way, if I just lob it up, boom. Now look, I'm not I'm not getting inside leverage. Now he's he's making plays. He's making better plays on the ball. Nothing I can really do. Uh, and then he's gonna get irritating. Damn. Like, come on. And most players like, just come on, make a play. Damn, now that time he made a play. But y'all see how the cornerback almost got. He almost got inside position to make a play on the ball. Like, look at this. Y'all see how that corner tried to get inside? Like, this is how football works in real life. Whoever gets that inside position, like, he's wedging me right here. He can make a play. Like, look at him. He's inside. Like, if he was just a little bit taller, he could have made a play. But, unfortunately, that's Terrence Williams. I'm telling you. I'm not. I know this might be bad. Y'all like, J-Mail. Bro, all you're doing is teaching people how to ag me, bro. But this is all you want to do. This is how you want to ask my. If you ever need to throw that ag dot. Like my boy Meta say. If you ever need to throw them ag dots, I got y'all. Y'all uh, see, just get that inside position. But I hope y'all enjoyed this. Don't go out there spamming it, abusing it. But until then, it's your boy J-Mail Flow, a.k.a. Mr. Let's Get It, Let's Go.